Hey guys, it's Mallory here with All About Cats, and in this video we're going to be taking a look at the top five best cat shampoos you can buy. So as many of you guys have probably realized, cats don't need to be bathed on a regular basis with the exception of certain situations. So sometimes you might find that you need to bathe your cat if they wander into the garage and get some motor oil on them, or if they're in the wrong place when somebody drops some nacho cheese. Something like that might necessitate a bath. But in general, cats are not going to need to take regular baths. There are some other exceptions. For instance, hairless breeds are going to need regular baths. Um, cats who have mobility issues or who are geriatric may need baths if they're unable to groom themselves properly. There are some situations um, that are going to necessitate regular bathing, but for the most part, cats do not need to take baths on a regular basis. But when you do bathe your cat, you're going to want to choose a good, high quality and safe cat shampoo. So the reason why you're not going to want to use your own shampoo or just any soap that is available is that cats are different from us. They have quite thin skin, they have very sensitive skin. Their skin has a somewhat different pH level than a human skin does. They're also very sensitive to fragrances and perhaps most importantly, they groom themselves after their bath. So if there's any residue left on their body after the bath, you're going to want to make sure that it's something that's safe for them to lick up. So in order to make these top five recommendations, I spent some time looking at the cat shampoo market, reading customer reviews, and getting a sense for which products were the most popular and seemed to work the best. Once I'd identified a few products that seemed to be working well, I purchased all of them and then I started testing them out. Now, for most of our reviews, uh, my cats test out the products, but for this one, I didn't really want to subject them to all of that bathing. I squirted out some of these shampoos. I looked at how well they lathered, and I also tested their pH using pH strips to compare them to one another and to a typical human shampoo. Typically, what people will say is that because a cat's skin is somewhat more alkaline than a human's, you're going to want to get a shampoo that's somewhat more alkaline than a human shampoo. So I took a look at how all of these products compared and I found that generally the cat shampoos were a little bit more alkaline than the human shampoo I tested, but there was a lot of inconsistency between them. During the reviews of each of these products, I'll mention the results of this test so that you can get a sense for how each of these products compare. So with all of that being said, our first recommendation is Earth Baths Fragrance-Free Hypoallergenic shampoo for pets. What I liked about the shampoo is that it's fragrance-free, meaning that it's not going to irritate your cat's skin or their nose. Overall, it seems to be a shampoo that's pretty gentle on your cat's skin, which isn't going to cause a lot of irritation. Now, when I took the pH strips to this particular shampoo, I found that it looked like it was lingering somewhere between a pH of 6 and 7. They say that they try to get their shampoos to be about a pH of 7, which is neutral and generally recommended for cats. So it seems like it's generally in that range. I couldn't really find much to dislike about this product. Perhaps the only concern is its price. At 91 cents per ounce, roughly, it's a relatively expensive product, certainly more expensive than just using something like Dawn dish soap, which we'll touch on later. The next shampoo that I want to recommend is Bear's Highlight Shampoo. So this is a shampoo that gets a lot of recommendations from veterinarians. It's formulated to moisturize your cat's skin, um, and it can be a good option if your cat has dandruff or particularly dry skin. I've also heard that it's a popular choice among Sphinx guardians, so it can be a good option for them as well. This shampoo is formulated with water as its primary ingredient. It also contains sodium C1416 olefin sulfonate, which is used as a foaming agent, cocomidopropyl betaine, which serves as a surfactant. It also contains sodium lactate, as well as PEG-150, which serves as an emulsifier and thickener, as well as PEG-75, which is an emulsifier, as well as a skin lubricant. It also contains uh, some added fragrance, dye, and preservatives. So overall, it does contain some ingredients that could potentially cause some irritation. I know that some reviewers have mentioned uh, issues with that, but overall for the majority of cats, this is going to be a good shampoo that helps to lubricate uh, and moisturize the skin. And during my test with the pH strips, it looked like the Bare Highlight Shampoo was about a pH of six. 
Now, I found that it can be a little bit difficult to find this shampoo. Its availability seems to be somewhat limited right now. And I've also found that its price can be really variable depending on how much of it you purchase. So I've seen its price ranging from between 62 cents per ounce all the way up to $2.41 per ounce if you're buying a smaller bottle. If you do find that you like this shampoo, it could be a good idea to invest in a larger volume of it as this can really bring your price per ounce down. Now, if you're interested in a shampoo conditioner blend, you might I consider Pro Pet Works shampoo and conditioner. The company says that this formula was made with pets with allergies in mind, and I've seen a lot of reviews from customers who say that it made their cat's coat extremely soft. So unlike a lot of the other shampoos we're mentioning here, it contains EGDA, which is a conditioning agent, as well as what is unfortunately a proprietary blend of skin conditioners and moisturizers. So again, we don't know exactly what is in this shampoo and conditioner. I found that the Pro Pet Works shampoo and conditioner was one of the lower pH products products that I tried with a pH of somewhere between four and five. Again, I've seen a lot of really positive reviews for this product and it could be a good option if you're looking for a shampoo and conditioner to use occasionally. But again, between the fact that it has a really strong smell that could be both annoying to you and your cat, along with the fact that it contains some ingredients that are not clearly named, this is one that I would hesitate a little bit before purchasing. Again, it gets really good reviews, but I'm just not completely sure about it. Another downside of this product is that it's fairly expensive at $1.09 per ounce. It's a little bit on the expensive side. And then my next recommendation is one that's probably going to be familiar if you've had cats for a while, and it is Dawn dish soap. Original Dawn is a really popular option for bathing cats. It's known to be a pretty gentle soap, and it's relatively safe to use on your cat, even if there's some residue left on their body after the bath. Now, this soap does contain sodium lauryl sulfate, which there are some concerns about, and it might not be a good option to use on a regular basis, but then again, most people aren't going to be bathing their cats on a regular basis. So for occasional use, this is a really good economical option that works quite well, and people have been trusting it for quite a long time. And interestingly, the pH of the Dawn dish soap was the closest to what is generally considered ideal for cats at around seven, especially if you have a situation where your cat suddenly gets dirty, something gets on them and you need to clean them right away. And you're not able to go purchase a cat shampoo. Dawn can be a really good option. At about 19 cents per ounce, this is one of the most economical options you can buy. And as a bonus, you can also wash dishes with it. Overall, a really budget friendly choice. And then our final recommendation is my favorite cat wipe. So if you want to do regular touch-ups and you don't want to subject your cat to a full bath, maybe your cat uh, hasn't been grooming themselves as well recently, you just need to touch up their coat a little bit, then you might want to consider a cat wipe. It's a nice way to be able to give your cat a little bit of assistance without forcing them to take an entire bath. So Pogi's pet wipes are hypoallergenic, made without a lot of irritating ingredients or ingredients that might harm your cat if licked off. And they contain a few additional ingredients that are intended to help to soothe and moisturize your cat's skin. So each wipe is infused with aloe vera, vitamin E, and Hawaiian awapahi, which are intended to safely condition your cat's coat as you clean it. A couple of things that I liked about these wipes is that they're very rugged. You can really tug on them, pull at them and they're not going to rip apart. And also the packaging seems to be pretty good. Um, I've had them for several weeks and I haven't noticed any drying. Um, it seems that the package reseals quite nicely. These wipes cost between nine and 11 cents per wipe. So again, a little bit on the expensive side. So that's about it for our list of the top five best cat shampoos you can buy. I hope that you found this helpful. If you're interested in more information on the products mentioned here, as well as some more details on how to bathe your cat, check out the link in the description or in the cards to visit the written version of this review. Again, it's going to go into a lot more detail and it'll also share some tips on bathing your cat. While you're in the description, you're also going to find links to all of the products mentioned here in case you want to buy them for yourself. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you're interested in more product reviews, buyer's guides, and information on all things cats, please go ahead and subscribe to the channel and don't forget to click the notification bell so you get the news every time we release a new upload. Thanks, bye.